Alright family, uh, we're back and uh, we're going to get into some Q&A from our other members. And I have my good sister here, Renee, and she's been incredible. Um, Renee was coming on the journey and next thing you know she talked about she wanted to get a plot in Garvey Town. And once again family, uh, uh, we're not uh, selling plots, uh, it's a shared agreement, it's, it's an investment. Uh, uh, Renee and her uh, uh, grandson, right? Yes. Um, and just, uh, sending all their paperwork and they were part of our group that traveled here this uh, May uh, 2019 and uh, she has been just incredible. I want to thank you for this uh, committing based on information that was able to share and everything and now you're here. Um, you have a list of questions now. Would you like to share with the uh, co-founders? Yes. Uh, one question is about, okay, so we know where our property plots are. Are there any walls that we can, you know, the block walls that we see going up around, can we put those? I don't know. Um, yeah, when, we, when we were talking about um, uh, Garvey Town, mm -hmm. one of the things we agreed on was we weren't building a prison. Right. So walls that are no ire. Okay. Then your shoulder. Then your shoulder. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, because we do not want, um, you know, that kind yeah. of us and them okay. attitude. Okay. Yeah. So we, we said we like about roughly about five foot okay. was the maximum height of um, walls, okay. would be fence walls. But yeah, you can put um, chain link fence, mm -hmm. uh, you know what I mean? You can use block mm -hmm. walls, but no higher than five foot. And those masons would be members that we can get prices from? Yes. Okay. So then the next thing is, since the lightning, the lightning, the, how you put the lights up, mm -hmm. the streets, the actual drainage, is that going up per cul-de-sac or? Yes. Okay. Yeah. That, uh, each cul-de-sac, uh, we build the houses. Mm -hmm. Um, we will not do the streets before the cul-de-sac is developed because the trucks that you use to bring the materials in and mm -hmm. out okay. will destroy the road. Okay. Yes. So when the um, cul-de-sac is done, mm -hmm. we will do the street. Um, we will, as part of doing that street, the drainage will be done. Okay. When the houses are built, uh, there is the sewage drainage is done. Okay. Uh, the wastewater drainage from your hand basins, your kitchen sinks and so on, your showers, baths, uh, those go to soak away in the ground. They just go back into the ground, into a hole that's made and filled with stones, and they soak back into the ground. Okay. Um, but the water from the sewage, sewage. that will go to a sewage treatment. So for each cul-de-sac, when it's as it's being built, um, it will be linked up to. At the end of that cul-de-sac will be a large septic tank, and then that septic tank will be then pumped periodically to where the sewage is treated. Okay. And then the next question is: You talked briefly about the community centers. That it could be a basketball. It could be this. Um, are we considering any bunkers here? Bunkers? <laughs> I'm just asking. Um, can I uh, ask to have this one off? Okay, good. Oh. Right, um, you can uh, answer that. We'll answer right. that we'll question we'll private. Okay, I'm just, I mean, uh, we'll we are private. planning communities. Well, that's one yeah, we'll just uh, continue the next question okay, and we'll, so we'll, then, we'll, we'll just so then answer the, that privately. Okay, that's fine. Uh, okay, so now, when we do start working on where we're going to have uh, the sustainable food that we do. Are we going to do the irrigation? Because I'm not sure if the water source is close or what are we doing? I, I'm not, I know um, that's a little away, but... Right. Uh, no, it's, it's not as far away as you think. Okay, great. <laughs> um, right. What happened is, right, there, there is a stream. A stream. It's a stream. At times of the year in Africa, it becomes a river, but it's a stream. Okay. <laughs> um, right. What, what will happen is um, within the next few months, um, Brother David's crew will start to 
planting the trees. Okay. We did that already um, when we came. That was one of our mistakes at the beginning. Uh, we planted thousands of fruit trees and stuff. Um, a fire destroyed them because the land wasn't being lived on. And so people come, hunters come and light fires, the thing, and the fruit trees died. Okay. So um, we're just waiting to get a couple more people here and then we start planting in the fruit trees okay. um, and running the communal farm. Okay. Yes. So that as members of the community come in, uh, they're not coming in to avoid when it comes to healthy food. They will be able to come in and at least get some of their staples from the community. Okay. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. The, the irrigation issue. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got a stream there. Um, we will be creating also rainwater tanks. Mm -hmm. um, and street guttering where we channel the water towards the farms so that we can store some of it for use yeah uh, yeah no we had borrows the, the salt levels too high mm. oh that's okay. um, then there's there's uh, like crystal salt below some of the ground here. okay yeah so where we were going to do it um it's not practicable Okay, and then uh, I think the last question I had had to do with, okay, you said, now when you start getting the surplus of money that's contributed to the community and the members or the sh uh, shareholders, will we be able to see the profit and loss? You, you're talking about the accounts? Yes. Um, right, uh, Garvey Town accounts, will be published okay yes for the community okay. right mm -hmm. every member of the community uh, will have access to uh, websites mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that all the accounts will be on okay um there's not gonna be any like you know, you know you can't there will be it will be an open book okay so you know where we think um right